Let's talk today a little bit about what do you do with your bare root purchase after you've picked it up and you are waiting to plant it in your garden space. You don't either have your garden space available yet or the ground is too frozen. Um, it's just early in the season and you wanted to take advantage of the fact that bare root was available, but you're not quite ready to put it in the ground. So what we don't want to do is have our bare root get dried out um, or have it be exposed to the sun and have the roots or any part of the plant become unviable. So a good way to hold it over simply is to put it in a container and then top it off with soil. Now this is designed to be a temporary thing. We're not going to be leaving them in these containers for um, a month or more. I mean, you can pot up your bare root no problem. That's not an issue. But this is really what we're doing here is a temporary holding space. And I've put my fruit trees into this container and now I've actually added my raspberries. This year I have a lofty goal of planting 25 of each type of strawberry that we carry in bare root. And I'm gonna need a lot of space. I'm not sure if I'm gonna regret this later, but I'm doing it anyway. But right now I need to hold them over. So instead of getting another container, I'm actually going to use a bag of acid planting mix, which strawberries really like a little bit of an acidic soil as well anyway. So I'm going to hold them over in this bag of acid planting mix, just that simple, don't need an extra container. Try to straighten out the roots a little bit better than I did there, but it's not the end of the world. Again, this is a temporary holding spot. I'm hoping to get these in the ground um, probably within the next week or so. And I just don't want them to sit around and get dried out or potentially let them rot in a plastic bag. So putting them in soil is a great way to both keep the roots moist and just kind of keep them in a holding pattern. Uh, it's been a little bit too cold to actually dig in my garden soil. It's warming up as we speak, but I am not ready yet. I've got travel plans. It's just not going to happen. So I wanted to make sure I grabbed my inventory before it ran out and now I can hold on to it. And when I'm ready to plant, I can do it. Uh, that's a little blackberry plug that I'm sticking in there as well. And I was able to fit like 15 little bundles of strawberries into this one bag. And I'm just going to pat it down, kind of make sure there's enough soil. I also got some asparagus. So I'm going to just take a deeper pot so I don't uh, bend the roots too much and just leave them in place there and then give them a healthy watering and also go back and double check that you didn't put too much soil over the roots of your trees you want to make sure the roots are covered but not much of the trunk uh, that's just good technique when you're planting it anyway and, and it's a good healthy way to hold them over that's it i'm comfortable leaving these guys for up to two weeks this way and when i get ready to plant them they'll be ready and happy to go but now let's say you are ready to plant you can actually just Take your plants and put them in a bucket of water for about 3 to 24 hours. I really recommend doing this to rehydrate the root zone before you put them in the ground so you're not planting anything that is a little bit dry, but dry.